In this activity, we're going to use our stamp game for subtraction. First, let's look at the question we're going to be working on. Here we go. 1,806 subtract 734. That top number is the one that I'm going to make with the stamps on our mat. I've gone ahead and made the number on the mat starting with the units. You can see them here. Six units. Now we're moving over to the tens place. So you can see in the question, it says zero, but we need to hold that spot. So I've taken out the blue disc that's in the stamp game box and it is holding the tens place on the mat. Now over to the hundreds. We're on the hundred stamps now. I've gone ahead and set them out on the mat. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight hundred stamps. Next to the hundreds is our thousands. For this question, we needed one thousand. So we have set out a 1,000 stamp on the mat to the left of our hundreds. And look at this, we've created the number we're going to subtract from. This is actually called the minuend. Yeah, in subtraction, we call this the minuend. Now that we have our minuend, we can start taking away or subtracting. And of course, what are we going to start taking away from? we start with the units. So I see in the question, we need to subtract four. Perfect. So I've gone ahead and I have counted out four units. So I can take these away and set them back in our stamp box. Now, we didn't have any tens, but that's okay. All we need to do is take one of the hundred stamps and I've just set it right here on the edge of the stamp game box and I can exchange that stamp for 10 tens. So I'm just going to count out 10, 10 stamps and set them here on the mat. Now that we have our 10 stamps, we can go ahead and start subtracting from those 10 stamps. Okay, one, two, three. We are subtracting three tens. Go ahead and put those back in the stamp game box. And if you want, you can record as you go along. You can see here, I have gone ahead and I've written down two in my units place and seven in the tens place because that's how many stamps I had left after doing the subtracting and now I'm going to go ahead and subtract the seven hundreds. There we go. So I have taken away these seven one hundred stamps and I'm going to put them back in the box. And of course, we ended up with zero. We ended up with no hundreds. Don't forget, you need to save that spot though. So I've taken out a red disc from the stamp game and set it on the mat. And recorded zero under the hundreds place here in the math book. And as I'm looking at the thousand, we are not taking away any thousands. 
So I'm still left with one. So that's it. We have the answer or what we call the difference in subtraction. Let's have a look. We have uh, two unit stamps. We have seven tens. We have zero hundreds and we have one thousand stamps. So our answer is one thousand seventy two. One thousand eight hundred six subtract seven hundred thirty four equals one thousand seventy two.